That war between Trump and Arnold Schwarzenegger is heating up. I want to just pray for Arnold if we can for those ratings, okay? Trump got it going by blasting his celebrity apprentice replacement at yesterday's national prayer breakfast. They hired a big, big movie star, Arnold Schwarzenegger, to take my place. And we know how that turned out. The ratings went right down the tubes. It's been a total disaster. Arnold hit right back. Hey, Donald, I have a great idea. Why don't we switch jobs? You take over TV because you're such an expert in ratings and I take over your job, and then people can finally sleep comfortably again. Hmm? I don't even know what to make of this, if anything. I don't have time to play for Arnold. I'm too busy praying for Melania. <laughs> <laughs> this morning, Trump took to Twitter and continued the bashing. Arnold Schwarzenegger did a really bad job as governor of California, and even worse on The Apprentice. But at least he tried hard. And Bruce Springsteen, performing in Melbourne, Australia, apologized for that tense phone call that the president had with the Prime Minister of Australia, one of America's closest allies. We stand before you, embarrassed Americans, tonight. <laughs> We're going to use this to send a letter back home. Don't hang up. Oh, no. And Caroline Kennedy is back in the U.S. following her resignation as ambassador to Japan. On the Today Show, she was asked about rumors that she was going to run for the U.S. Senate from New York. Do you have aspirations for elected office? Um, you know, I just got home, and uh, so it's great to be home. So I really you've been home a week or so. I've been home a week or so, yeah. So, um, so I really I'm looking around for to figure out what I'll do next. But wouldn't rule it out. Um, well, I think I'd rather be on morning TV. Or <laughs>